This is our corner template, and it would be on the yellow piece, which will be right out here when we get the quilt put together. Mm -hmm. But you're going to put the template down on the piece. It would be like, like this. right here, right? Exactly. Mm -hmm. And just draw around this with um, a marking tool. And then cut along that edge, and what that does is just give you a rounded corner, which serves a couple of good purposes. I love the way it looks, but it also means I don't have to turn a corner on the serger, which is a little easier. Right. So that's one of those times when style and function come together really well for you. So we just do the two corners on this edge, the two corners on that edge. That's exactly right. And then we're ready for ruffling. Then we're ready for ruffling. Great. Okay. So... The next thing that you need is your ruffle strips, and these I have just cut rotary cut. I would recommend rotary cutting for all of this. It's just so quick and simple to do, mm -hmm. although it would be possible to tear these pieces if you prefer to do that instead of rotary cutting. But what I've done for our ruffle is I have just cut pieces all the way across the fabric, so we still have the selvages on the end, Okay. and we're going to make just the most basic ruffle out of this. So we put two pieces with their right sides together. And I suppose you could make your ruffle as wide as you like. Yes, 